Hello, my name is Jamie King, Hilliard Learning Engineer. Welcome to our review of proper surface disinfection during the COVID-19 pandemic. We'd like to take some time to review proper Hilliard product and surface disinfection. When using any new cleaning or disinfecting product, read the label directions for proper usage. Review the safety data sheet, paying close attention to section eight, which provides information pertaining to the appropriate personal protection equipment. For products that are dispensed through Hilliard dilution control devices, like the Arsenal One dispenser, safety data sheets are available for both the concentrate product and the product in ready to use state. For disinfection of the SARS-CoV-2 virus, which causes the COVID-19 infection, an EPA-registered disinfectant must have an emerging pathogen and supporting pathogen claim, a human coronavirus claim, or an updated registration with a SARS-CoV-2 claim. Hilliard offers eight disinfectants with the proper claims. QT, QT3, QT+, QTTB, Rejuvenol, Rejuvenol HBV, Vindicator Plus, and Non-Acid Restroom Cleaner Disinfectant. QT3 is a dilutable, spray-only disinfectant with a three-minute contact time for SARS-CoV-2. QTTB is a ready-to-use disinfectant with a one-minute contact time for SARS-CoV-2. Both products can be applied to the surface with a spray bottle, pump-up sprayer, or electrostatic sprayer only if the sprayer is not in electrostatic mode. Hilliard QT Plus is a dilutable disinfectant with a three minute contact time for SARS-CoV-2. Vindicator Plus QT and Rejuvenol HBV are dilutable disinfectants with a 10 minute contact time for SARS-CoV-2. They can be applied to a surface with a spray bottle, pump up sprayer, dip bucket, or charge bucket. Rejuvenol and non-acid restroom cleaner disinfectant are dilutable disinfectants with a 10 minute contact time for SARS-CoV-2. They can be applied to a surface with a spray bottle, pump up sprayer, dip bucket, charge bucket, or with a Hilliard cleaning companion. Be sure to use the appropriate personal protection equipment Wear safety glasses when mixing product or pouring product into a secondary container. Wear gloves when mixing, applying, or wiping disinfectant to prevent skin irritation. Please refer to the product SDS for detailed information. Use secondary labels on any container that may leave your control. There are several methods that can be used to apply disinfectant. Dip buckets can be used with all products except QTTB and QT3. This method uses a single microfiber cloth that is continually recharged in the bucket of disinfectant solution. Disinfectant solution should be changed often to ensure proper disinfectant charge. Buckets with microfiber cloth or pads can be used with all products except QT3 or QTTB. To use this method, Place microfiber cloths or pads in a clean charge bucket. Add the proper amount of pre-diluted disinfectant to the container and let the microfiber soak for at least five minutes before use. Remove and use a microfiber as needed. Do not return used microfiber to the charge bucket. When available, the charge bucket method is preferred over a dip bucket. Core spray devices can be used to dispense all Hilliard disinfectants. To disinfect, the product should be dispensed directly onto the surface with a coarse spray. Following the proper wet dwell time, the surface can be wiped with a microfiber cloth to remove any excess disinfectant. Electrostatic sprayers can be used to dispense QTTB and QT3 only if the sprayer is not in the electrostatic mode. Be sure to apply enough disinfectant so the surface remains wet for the full EPA required product contact time. 
Once the contact time has been achieved, wipe excess disinfectant from the surface to prevent chemical buildup. If students will be eating food at their desk, you must follow disinfection with a potable water rinse. The use of microfiber with a charge bucket system is also an effective method for efficient disinfection of student desks. When considering how often to disinfect student desks, it's a good idea to disinfect desks that are used by multiple students more often. Desks that are assigned to only one student do not require disinfection as frequently. When disinfecting large areas of flat surfaces, such as tables, different methods can provide more efficient disinfection. Use a pre-charged 11-inch microfiber pad for quick and effective disinfection. Change out pads as they become soiled or as the amount of disinfectant remaining on the pad prevents achieving a proper wet dwell time. Large areas can also be disinfected with a Hilliard Cleaning Companion. Set the spray nozzle to low pressure, then spray the surface with a sweeping motion. Apply enough product to wet the entire surface. After 10 minutes of wet dwell time, use a dry microfiber to wipe off any excess disinfectant. For lunch tables, follow with a potable water rinse. To prevent oversaturating a computer keyboard and tracking mouse, use a disinfectant dampened microfiber from a charge bucket to wipe down the keyboard and mouse. Wipe the surface a second time if it starts to dry before the required wet dwell time has been met. When disinfecting a public use facility, it is important to disinfect the high touch areas. These areas include doorknobs, water fountain buttons, elevator buttons, stair rails, soap and sanitizer dispensers, and manual paper towel dispensers. Special care should be taken when disinfecting electrically connected services. For example, light switches should only be wiped down, never directly sprayed. For disinfecting a smartphone, smart board, or tablet, please refer to the device manufacturer recommendations. Clean these surfaces often. Wipe them with a microfiber cloth that has been pre-moistened with a window cleaner. When these devices are handled by multiple users, is a good idea for all users to wash or sanitize their hands before and after use. Hilliard is proud to offer a full line of laundry and wear wash products. Pot and Pan Sanitizer 21 has the proper EPA established claims to combat the COVID-19 outbreak. Whenever dealing with the current COVID-19 pandemic, influenza, or other common community associated diseases, your facility disinfection plan should focus on the commonly touched surfaces in your facility. The use of fogging devices is not recommended and for the most part does not provide an infection control benefit. Please remember your best source for current information concerning the COVID-19 pandemic is the Center for Disease Control. Their website is www.cdc.gov. Thank you for joining us today and please keep watching for more videos coming soon.